guys it don't happen again or you don't cast watch this video and see what thing about president or see what thing they talk see what thing that they ask and see what thing they answer in answer and the question you know relates it's like you they ask for a somebody they give you b how that they relate then they ask you say before you come office see what the dollar be see how nigeria be see what it they grand but now in between six seven years everything don't destroy dollar don't hide people know if you do business again to spend to hit it don't they hard everything don't powerful car but see what in the answer Imagine you they ask your picking, small picking, they answer a question, they ask and say, wait to be this, if they tell you another thing. You know, go beat them, but see what in our own president, or what we call president, where in the rule 200 million plus, and we see our country go move forward. I want them to move forward. But we don't understand simple question. I go take move country forward. Yeah, you know now, you know now, you know, say you know capable, but because, oh, now my tribe. Now my this one, now my religion does this one, now religion that, and they kill us, they kill our future. We cannot continue with this. Simple question, they give another answer. Watch it yourself now. Watch the video. May not be like say, now me they talk with you and no see. You watch it yourself. Listen to the question. Come listen to the answer. May you come be the judge. If we come back, we'll come talk about the video. Oh yeah, watch it yourself. Where the nation was when you took over uh, office uh, in 2015, our debt stock at the time was about 12 trillion. Now it is about 32 trillion. Inflation rate was about 9%. It is now sitting about over 15%. Unemployment rate was about 8.19%. It is now 33.28%. Uh, exchange rate was about 197 naira to a dollar. It's way over. 400 naira to a dollar so people will look back economically speaking and say look um before you took over office some of these indicators were fair and now the figures are not friendly at all well i'm not sure how correct the calculations are but all i know is that uh, we have to allow people to get access to the farms. As I said, we just have to go back to the land. We have to go back to the land. What we have done so far, as I said, we have achieved some successes. And people ought to uh, measure our successes vis-a-vis -vis the problems when we started. You have given your figures as, 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 as you as you calculated. But the important thing is this, that uh, uh, the farms that, you know, produce uh, machinery and so on, tractors and so on, we have to build the infrastructure. And we have identified the infrastructure we need. We have to make the rail working. We have to make uh, the roads. And uh, if you have listened to the Minister of Works and Housing, how much of the roads we have built and rehabilitated, and how much of the rail we have done. And if you talk to the Minister of uh, Transportation, the planned uh, transportation from Lagos to Ibadan, then to the east, then from Port Harcourt to Maiduguri, and then from here to Kano, and even up to, up to Niger. Um, I think we, we need to uh, appreciate what we have done with what we have within the time we have been here. So now as you watch the video, like what do you think? So do you think we should vote for old people like that? Because to me, I don't see anything where these old people feel offer again like their thinking faculty is too low because the level where technology they go now is kind of beyond their thinking 
So we need a young one with good energy, with vision. You know what I mean? Someone who have the feelings of the citizens. Not those who doesn't even know what people are going through. People who will be say to treat themselves, not to travel, go abroad. You no, know, be that kind of people we want. So this coming election, we need to vote right. We need to use our number six to choose our right leader. When I know the, when I know the right one now, so I don't, I don't need to mention anybody's name. You know, if you know the capable, the one that capable for the job, you know. So I don't need to tell you. You know what I mean. So we need to vote for competent, not by tribe, not by religion. So may we forget that one now. Because this country ship is almost sink. If you no know one made the country ship sink, we need to do something. We need to vote the right person. So my people, we will vote the right person, okay? But I beg, do me one favor, don't forget to subscribe for me. I beg. As you watch my videos, please subscribe. Please. I did not beg at the beg. Subscribe, like, share, comment, and click that notification button. If I post another video, I swear you go, you go now you go first see him. I promise.